Keeping your Mac in top shape when using real-time applications such as Pro Tools is essential for a great session. These optimizations can solve potential error messages resulting from background system activity. Performing these optimizations prior to your session will help achieve maximum performance in Pro Tools. From your desktop, go to the Apple menu in the top left-hand corner and choose System Preferences. When they open, the first thing you want to do is disable the Screen Saver. There are only two tabs here, so it's easy to find. Just grab the slider, move it to the full right position to turn it off completely. OK, Expose and Spaces. In the Expose tab, there's a key command assigned to the dashboard function, F12. This is a key command that is used by Pro Tools, so you want to free it up or assign something else to it. Next, security. The File Vault system on your Macintosh encrypts all of the files in your home folder and then unencrypts them every time you need them. Make sure File Vault is off. Now, Spotlight is the Mac search engine. It uses the same key as the record function in Pro Tools, command space. Now, when this is turned on, the command space keystroke triggers Spotlight in the top right-hand corner of your screen. And this is what's going to happen every time you hit record in Pro Tools. So you want to make sure you turn this off. Now, let's go to the Privacy tab and drag in your audio drive to disable indexing of that drive. In fact, go ahead and add your main Macintosh hard drive too, because indexing can interrupt you at the most inopportune time, like while you're cutting a nice vocal track. Let's go to the energy saver. We don't want the computer ever sleeping. Same thing for the display or monitor, and uncheck the option to put the hard drives to sleep. Now, as far as the network settings, these can be different depending on the computer that you own. But if you have AirPort installed, turn it off while you're recording or while you're working in Pro Tools. Now, if you have a FireWire port in the network pane, you want to make sure that it's configured to be off, especially if you own a 003. You'll have to apply the network settings when you go back to the control panel. Now, Bluetooth can be a problem for real-time music applications. You really want to make sure that your Bluetooth system is turned off while you're in session. Software update. Just configure this so it doesn't do it automatically. This is mainly to prevent auto-updating your OS version, which has the possibility of causing compatibility issues. Finally, turn the Time Machine system off. You can always do your backups manually. And that's it. You are done. This pre-flight check will become second nature after a while, allowing you to have a better Pro Tools experience. You can also get to the system preferences by coming down to the dock and clicking on the icon, or go up to the Go menu, choose Applications, and when the window opens, scroll down until you see them.